Republic's coal, your coal, our coal, at the time of serious budget cutting. Why isn't the BLM bothering to study all the impacts of mining on the area's water resources and ranch land? This coal sale should not go forward until these questions are answered. That's right! Yeah. This coming Wednesday, November 16th, the BLM will hold a coal lease sale for 35 million tons of coal in the Bull Mountains. This coal is under private surface. The coal is owned by the people of the United States. This coal is being grossly undervalued by the BLM. You got that right. In fact, they are literally giving away millions of tons of coal. Single Peak Energy is currently mining the Mammoth and Raider seams. The, the monetary and environmental evaluation of this coal is based solely on the mining of the Mammoth seam, but the coal lease consists of all the coal reserves recoverable by underground mining methods. There are 13 additional seams in this, in this area to be leased. One of these seams is the Raider seam that is currently being mined. This coal seam is apparently being given away. Additionally, two more seams are currently considered mineable at this time, according to Don Dimache, the president of Signal Peak. And they, he has stated many times that they intend to mine these seams. The BLM is putting no value on this coal. When these additional seams are mined, the whole destructive process of subsidence would happen two more times. The BLM has made no consideration of the impacts of mining these additional seams as required by law. <laughs> the blatant giveaway of public resources at a time of severe budget cutting should not be allowed to happen. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. The sale should be stopped until all the pool is appraised at fair market value. Yeah. 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 Also, a full environmental impact statement should be done based on mining all these seams. Yeah. 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 Further, the impact statement should also look at the serious effects of subsidence cracking that has taken place. That's right. That's the right. Long Wall right. Mine has been in operation for two years, and instead of looking at what's actually happening, the BLM has chosen to base their assessment on 20-year-old stale information that is proving to be false. That's right! The large surface cracks that were supposed to heal in six months have not healed after two years. Nationalized energy. We have a few people for the BLM outside. We appreciate that, but the ones inside, we want them to hear us. Those sweetheart nails go!